in New Jersey lies a place known as the Forgotten County, full of swamps and rivers. But some believe that this river is home to a strange beast known as the Mantis. All around the globe, people around the world have strange sightings of creatures that science cannot identify. But now a brave group of explorers and researchers travel the globe to search for these unidentified beasts. Hello, people. I am Gizmo. Meet the Cryptid Hunter. What's up, my amazing team? Well, there he is, our favorite team leader, Robert Walker himself. So, what are we going after today, my good sir? Yeah, what are we going after today? Better be something ferocious. Today, we're going back to New Jersey. This time, in a town called Hecketstown. Town. Traveling to the Musconnectong River after the Mantis Man. Ooh. A giant prey mantis? Uh. Ew. Seriously, how old are you? Gwen, you're a coward. Now pack up your stuff, because we're heading to New Jersey once again. A long road trip from Colorado all the way to New Jersey. Here's what we do know about the Mantis Man. It was first sighted in the early 2000s. It's 8 foot tall. Weighs somewhere in 91.8 G's, 0 0.9 O's, can turn invisible, lives near river banks, it's brownish in color, tries avoiding people, and it's also said to be translucent. And here's my picture of this mantis creature. Pretty good, right? So sir, tell us how you encountered the Mantis Man. Of course, it all started while I was fishing. I was fishing a little close to the river. And then I noticed some movement in the trees. So I thought it was just some type of animal, so I didn't pay much attention to it. But then it started to move closer. And you know, that starts to get your attention. And when I looked up... Very closely in the bushes, I saw what looked like a giant prey mantis. It scared me so much that I ran out of there. 
I didn't even go back to grab any of my fishing gear. I just left. Hmm. Interesting story. Don't worry, sir. We're going to try to capture that mantis man. Oh, good. Cause who knows what that thing could do to people. I tell ya. So right now, me and Robert are about to go investigate the wilderness. So we brought this dog here to track down the scent. We believe that this half-eaten fish we found might have been eaten by the mantis man. So if he smells that scent, he'll surely track down this bug-like monster. Now go track him down, boy. I'm back. This time, I'm searching for a giant prey mantis. Something's in here. I got a bad feeling about this. Oh yes, we're ready for our life our giant prey mantis! Hello, brother. Uh, hey. So we're going after a giant prey mantis. What do you have in mind to trap it? Well, here are my plans. Let's see here. I'm thinking of a gigantic butterfly-like trap left open for the mantis man to go in. When he goes in, he's going to trip a little wire system in there. He'll go in to try to grab the bait. And when he does, boom, that door closes on him. And he's trapped. And we'll have the evidence to prove his existence. So basically, we're using a giant butterfly trap to capture a giant prey mantis. Yep. Okay, I'll get the stuff. Wait for me! Ladies and gentlemen, me and my brother Mac over there are proud to present the overgrown butterfly trap. This was provided to us thanks to the help of Wild Adventures. And might I say the manager over there is very nice. Get on with it already, you idiots! Never seen him this testy before. I'm tired of waiting. So how about we just get out there, set up our trap, and hunt down that overgrown bug. Not everything is built in just one day, dude. Yeah, this took a while to build. Alright, here we go. Alright, where's that switch thing? I think it's right here. Yep, this is it. Quick, pull! Aha! The trap's all set up, and the bait is in the trap. We are ready! Alright, here's the plan. Bob, Mac, you're gonna be with Jack. What? <sighs> fine. Papa Bear will travel with Smug and General Bot. Hooray. So that leaves Gwen and Gizmo with me. Gee, I'm lucky. Ladies and gentlemen, this is exciting. 
Oh dear. We're about to have close contact with an insect that's believed to have been, that's believed to exist during a long time ago, back during the Carboniferous period, the time of giant bugs. Ugh, stupid sticks. Out of all the places I have to go through to track down the truth, this has to be one of the most places I hate. Uh, watch out there. There's nothing here. I don't see anything. It has to be around here somewhere. I want to throw a stick in there or something. Wow, they really took me literal. <laughs> oh, I'm out of here. There's no signs of it around here. Do any of you get that feeling that you're being watched? Because I'm getting that feeling right now, and I hate getting that feeling. It ticks me off. Ugh. Oh, that was... Oh, Gwen. Robert? So we... So I guess we're stuck together right now. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's here! Guys, run. Oh, 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 it's coming at us! <laughs> okay, I think the problem was that we just got too close to its territory, so it tried to chase us out. So now, we have to get out of here before it tries to chase us. Okay, here's the way out of here. Gwen, follow me! This is a huge swamp. Oh, there it is! Chase it to the trap! We did it! It's in the trap! And the wind's still blowing on our thing. We captured the mantis man. We pulled it off. Yep, we captured a giant prey mantis. After what just happened tonight, I can definitely confirm that the Mantis Man exists right here in the swamplands of New Jersey. Mantis Man? Whoops. Confirmed. <laughs>